Hello everyone, this is Nate with Photodex, and today I'm going to show you how to embed a slideshow that you've made with ProShow into your own blog or website. If you're not familiar with embedding, it basically refers to when you have a video that is located someplace else, but plays directly on your website. You probably see this every day. For example, when someone shares a video on their Facebook timeline, or when you see a video tutorial posted on a blog. Embedding is great because it allows you to quickly add video content to your web presence without having to build any complex web pages. But before you can embed your show, the first thing you'll need to do is get it online. If you're not familiar with how to do that, visit our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash Corporation. There you'll find a tutorial that walks you through how to upload shows to YouTube, Facebook, and Vimeo. Once your show is online, YouTube and Vimeo both make it incredibly easy to embed a show onto your website or blog. Let's start with YouTube. First, find the show you want to embed. Next, click the share button just beneath the video. Now, click on embed. This will give you the HTML code you'll need to embed the video on your own site. Simply copy this code to your clipboard. You can also right-click on the video and select Copy Embed HTML. If you've uploaded your show to Vimeo, you have the same options. The Share button will be located here in the top right corner of the video. Click Share, then select and copy all of the embed code from this window. Again, you can also right-click and select Copy Embed Code. With the code copied to your clipboard, now we need to paste the code into a web page. For those of you who have a blog or edit websites online, let's take a look at how to publish a post with an embedded video. For this example, I'm going to use WordPress to create a new post with an embedded video for my blog. First, let's add a new post. Now, because we're adding HTML embed code, we need to make sure that we select HTML up here in the corner. Now, paste the embed code into the text field. And that's it. From here, I can add whatever text I'd like to have appear above or below the embedded video. Let's preview the post to see how it looks. In this example, I think the size of the video is a little small, but that's not a problem. I can easily change the size of the video to better fit the layout of my blog. Let's go back to the post. In the embed code, you'll see tags for the width and height of the video. Simply change these to whatever works best for you. In order to keep your video from becoming distorted, be sure to maintain the same width to height ratio. In this case, 400 divided by 300 is a ratio of 1.33. If I change the width to 500, I want to change the height to 375. It might take a little bit of math and some trial and error to get it right, but the extra effort will be worth it in the end. Let's take a look at the adjusted video size. And that looks much better. And that's it for today's lesson. Be sure to check out our other training videos on our YouTube channel or visit our blog for helpful tips and tricks about creating slideshows with ProShow.